Let's begin with an update coming in from the Tihar jail. The enforcement directorate team that was questioning Manish Sisodia has just left. So six hours of marathon grilling that Manish Sisodia was put through. Uh, and after that, now the ED team has left. We're going to try and get you details of what really is the takeaway of this interrogation. But it was expected that the Enforcement Directorate, which is also probing the liquor scam besides the CBI, would in fact question Manish Sisodia on the money trail of the alleged liquor scam. Six hours that Manish Sisodia was questioned within the Tihar jail. Shreya Chatterjee is joining us live with more details so on this. So Shreya, after six hours, the ED questioning of Manish Sisodia has come to an end. Any information you've been able to pick up uh, on the questionnaire? What kind of details were really sought? Well, uh, you know, Akshita, the questioning today revolved around the charges that against Manish Sisodia is involvement in flouting rules and framing the liquor policy, the changes that were made, the first policy that was deleted. These were the questions that he faced as we are picking up from our sources in the Enforcement Directorate. Now, the questioning uh, went on for approximately six hours. It was post 11.40 that uh, the uh, ED team had entered Tihar Jail and now just barely 15 minutes from when we are right now, uh, the ED team has left. Uh, the premise, it's also important to mention that uh, there were two other p individuals who were brought by uh, a second ED team while the questioning was going on. In all likelihood, there was, they were uh, cross-questioned with Manish Sisodia and, present, and he was presented with material evidence. So that's something that transpired in day one of the questioning. Important to mention that there is three days that uh, ED has secured from the court to question Manish Sisodia inside jail. So we'll have to wait for some more time to know that when he will again be uh, questioned but as of now it was a six hours of grilling that went inside uh, Tihar jail in all likelihood this will follow. Uh, do we know if Sisodia was cooperative because so far uh, in every court hearing Shreya and this is the CBI of course who had custody of him earlier they've maintained that Sisodia has been completely uncooperative. Well, that was primarily one of the reasons why he was arrested because he was also charged with destruction of evidence. Now, after the arrest made by CBI and his, the custody with CBI getting over, we are right now seeing the enforcement directorate kicking in. It's important to mention that this is also coming at a time that the ED has also leveled its game up against the south cartel of uh, this liquor policy scam. Today, Arun Pillai uh, was another person who was arrested by the ED. This was the 11th arrest that was made by the enforcement directorate. They were middlemen who were involved in uh, making meetings in between the officials who are framing the policy and also um, they were also responsible in uh, receiving kickbacks and undue advances. This entire money trail is something that the Enforcement Directorate is now uh, looking into. What we also do know that uh, the Enforcement Directorate has evidence at hand which directly nails Mani Sisodia. That's primarily the reason they had moved okay. forth yesterday evening to question Mani Sisodia after the permission was granted. They question him today inside the hard jail. Okay, we'll track the latest that comes in on the Shreya telling us that it's going to be essentially a repeat of this tomorrow as well with the Enforcement Director team expected at the Tihar Jail tomorrow to question and continue the grilling of Manish Sisodia. Thanks Shreya for getting us those details.